These words have been blurred out because most of them are even too explicit to broadcast. They are found on a number of websites and include sexually explicit descriptions of how to, among other things, masturbate and act out your fantasies. And those are the tame ones, descriptions one would find in an X-rated magazine or perhaps an erotic novel. However, these articles, under the auspices of sexual advice, were linked to the Toronto District School Board website. Why is this uh, list on here? We showed some university students what had been posted. This is their reaction. Kids should know some stuff, but I don't know, maybe that's it's a bit descriptive. Some of those words are not words that kids should know yet. I hope. This list of resources was intended uh, for information purposes for those that are interested about healthy sexuality and healthy relationships that are not covered by the, the standard curriculum. And as a result of the fiery reaction these sites have provoked, all links that people have expressed some concerns about are now being removed from our website and will be reviewed. One of the websites that the TDSB linked to was the, quote, Coalition for Positive Sexuality. The article titled, Just Say Yes, Pro-Sex. This social scientist says sex education has always been, dare I say, a hot topic for the TDSB. And while not endorsing the websites, David Rayside believes information for students in schools has traditionally been inadequate. I think there has been a recognition that there has to be franker discussion of that, but clearly there are boundaries at, at various age levels about what you talk about, but there's always an unease about that and a pushback. Earlier this week, the Toronto District School Board was criticized for its most recent ad campaign, some saying it's gone too far. Some of the images include depicting young children cross-dressing, some even saying one promotes polygamy. The TDSB denies that, defending the campaign, saying it's aimed at preventing gender-based violence. Now this. If my teacher said things off the website, I would just be uncomfortable. Anthony Robart, Global News.